How about a way to attract beautiful butterflies into your garden? You watched us design and build this house in 150 days, but the work is far from over. We're about to jump into my favorite part of the process of bringing all this together. Join me for an exclusive look right here on eHow Home. One of the things I look forward to with getting the garden planted is that I can begin to share this garden with other things, namely butterflies. This particular plant that I have here is one that attracts butterflies. It's a budlia or butterfly bush. Now what I love about this plant is that this one is actually a low growing one. In fact, its name is Lo and Behold Purple Haze. You can see the gorgeous long blooms on it. Butterflies love it. You see this dwarf form of butterfly bush I like very much because it's horizontal and it spreads out so it'll fill this whole area. And the other thing about butterfly bushes is that they are perennial. These are shrubs that will stay in your garden for years to come. And they're constantly throwing off these really long, beautiful blooms. You can see once the bloom fades, it looks like this, but as new ones come on, they look like this. All very beautiful forms. I chose to plant these butterfly bushes here on this corner in a mass grouping so they'll create a lot of strong visual effect. You wanna plant butterfly bushes in full sun. These will grow to about 36 inches tall and then they stop. That's why I like this dwarf form because you don't have to cut them back constantly. Lo and behold, purple haze budlia is not invasive. It doesn't set seed and come up everywhere in the garden. The other thing that's good about it is that it's deer resistant. So if you have problems with deer, you might think about some of these budlias. If you grow a butterfly bush in your garden, I'd love to hear about it. Tell a friend about our segments. Make sure you subscribe to eHow Home.